our featured staff member of the month here at Paris Nursing and Rehabilitation. And this month we have Patricia Fuller. And Patricia is a rehab tech. Uh, tell us what that means. Um, it means that I assist our physical therapist here, whose name is Bing Tan, and our occupational therapist here named Kelly Wickersham. And what we do here is do all the rehab, rehabilitation for our residents here at Paris Nursing Rehab. And part of our goal is to maintain um, as much independency as possible and let them gain that independency back from recuperating from surgery or just anything that we might need to adjust for them. Sure. As I came in this morning, set up for uh, for this uh, interview, uh, there was a group of uh, folks, uh, some in wheelchairs, uh, you know, some on walkers, uh, but all being addressed with uh, some sort of a, a rehabilitation techniques and so forth. Uh, is that a daily routine for these residents? Yes, sir. It's a daily routine that we do. Uh, we have people, like you said, they're in wheelchairs. Um, that are on walkers, that are ambulatory, and our goal is, like I said a moment ago, to give them to maintain as much independency as possible. And, uh, and you know, what I saw and witnessed uh, was a smile on a lot of those faces because uh, it's helping return mobility and, uh, uh, you know, f function uh, to their uh, uh, to their daily routine and so forth. So it means a lot to them as well. It does. Um, each of our residents that comes down here for our rehabilitation, um, when it's time to discharge them, they just hate to leave. Um, they say that it's an enjoyment for them, and it's also an enjoyment for us, and that's what makes it a very pleasant place to come to work when you know that your residents are here and they like coming to rehab. It's almost like P.E. in school. I remember, how, you know, what, uh, how much fun, how you look forward to, to, to that part of the day. It's sort of like that for, uh, for these folks. Right. You know, they come down here and um, they exercise with us. Their goal is to go home. And that's what our goal is, to get them functionable where they can maintain independency at home.